What's going on guys, Prubart here with a quick Vegas uh, tutorial I would call it. Um, if you ever had this screen come up, I had it in the middle of a project I was working on. Uh, it kind of upset me, I was like, oh no, what do I do now? Um, there is a way that you may potentially be able to re restore that file. Um, essentially what you're going to have to start out by doing is, you are going to have to show your hidden folders. Uh, so if you go into the control panel, uh, go to appearance and settings and then go to show hidden folders once you click on this under the view tab you do have to check in the show hidden folders this is the only way that the the application file for sony vegas is going to come up so just make sure you do that once you show the hidden folders we're done with this so you could exit out and then what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go to your c drive or whatever your main drive is for windows go to users and then whatever your user is and then there's a, a thing for app data in app data go to the local folder and then you just have to navigate to the sony drive the sony folder once you're in the sony folder um, it should list your vegas and then the, whatever version you're running once you get in there there are it'll have a whole bunch of auto saves now it may not be the most current project if it crashed like right after you did something but I don't know what the time frame that Vegas saves is. But if you rename these .bak files, you delete that part of it. And then when it prompts you to, are you sure you want to rename it? If you do that and you double click on it, it'll open that project. Now, if you do do a lot of projects in Sony Vegas, there are going to be a number of projects. So it might, uh, it might take you a little bit to find the one that you want. I sorted mine by date and time this way because I knew right when it crashed. Um, it was only a few minutes before that it had auto saved, so I used that. But um, I just wanted to put this out there in case if there is anyone out there that didn't know. And if it did help you out, uh, definitely leave a thumbs up. And uh, I'll see you in the next one. Thanks a lot.